Hi guys, so I'm working on my the outside of the bus because I have to sand the whole thing down to repaint it. So I was out there and I was talking to somebody yesterday and I came across the vibration that I don't think I've talked about before and I should. And the vibration was one of doubt. Now I don't really have that vibration and that's probably why I haven't talked about it because I did it. You know, there's no doubt for me, but I have this huge advantage that I died, and I'm doing the best I can to explain to you guys, sorry, to you guys what I saw and how it works. Um, I'm doing the best I can, guys. I do not have a history in, in public speaking or anything like that, so I'm doing the best I can to get the information out to you. But I did run across that vibration of doubt, and I don't blame you guys for that at all. Because you've been told so many stories by people who can talk much better than I can, who can win the hearts and souls and minds of people by speaking, and I am probably not going to do that. So I don't blame you for having doubt, and all I can do for you in that one is to you got to go within yourself. You know what's true and what's not. I promise you, you do. If you trust yourself, if you really trust yourself, don't, don't be pulled in by the bells and whistles. If somebody is telling you that it is easy, is does that, do you believe that? I mean, really, do you believe that? Do you believe that being here and your day-to-day -day life is easy and there's any way that it can be. I mean, if you believe that in your soul, well, then maybe you're a long, long-term human and it is easy for you. But even you have hard times. So this, this isn't easy and nothing's going to make it easy. It is a unique creationary experience. It, it very definitely is. And like I've told you guys over and over, if something that I say does not feel right to you, then leave it. Leave it. Stop listening to me if it doesn't feel right. Because there's many, many paths that are the right way. There's infinite right ways. And it may not be listening to me. That doesn't mean that you that you're not going to get there. Uh, there isn't just one way, guys. There's not one person to listen to. Listen to everybody and then mostly listen to yourself. You will know what is right for you. It will feel right. It will always feel right. Um, trying to get to that is the trick because you'll have all of these different things that have happened to you. You will have many people have said, well, this is the way that you believed and it didn't work. Now, most of the time, I believe there is truth in everything, and it just kind of gets twisted, sometimes by the person who's sharing it. Sometimes I've seen they do it for a long time, and they maybe do it as a business. And in order for things to be a business, sometimes you have to do it a certain way and make it marketable. And things kind of get twisted along the way. But ultimately, I think there's truth in just about everything if you if you look for it. So what I want to say to you guys is I totally get the doubt. Oh, I totally do. And you have every right to feel it. And you should. But you can sort through all of this if you just listen to yourself. Listen to yourself on the inside. Not what society's taught you. Not, not any of that. Just go really, really to the inside of you. And you've just got to know yourself. And that's part of this this thing that I'm telling you. You've got to learn who you are and trust you. And you are the one that knows what's right for you. Okay? All right. That's it on this one. Uh, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. Thank you for those... Who support me on Patreon and PayPal is so appreciated. Thank you for those who do the sessions with me. Again, they're interesting and it's nice to meet you. And uh, yeah, an interesting thing happened to me here the la last couple of days. We were evacuated 
because they had a spill on the road down the way and it was something they use in fracking but they wouldn't tell us what it was so uh, fortunately we put out some stuff around this farm and so it was just right outside of our line but unfortunately we're right on the highway and they blocked it off completely so they came and kicked us out of the house and left us till they could get it cleaned up so interesting there's a story behind that too so thank you guys so much for watching and uh, I love you so much and I'll see you later bye now